Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today we are going to be trying the brand new Wishful Skin Yo Detox Scrub. I feel like my skin is in desperate need of this right now. I have just taken all the makeup that I've just had on off my face and I've washed my face. So I just went in with the Fenty Skin Cleanser. Now I am so excited for this because this isn't just a Yo Detox face scrub, it's a face and body scrub. I have desperately been trying to find a good body scrub everywhere. So I know Wishful is not gonna let me down. Now I have already got and tried the Yo Glow Enzyme Scrub. Um, that came out maybe a year ago or something like that. And I use that literally like once or twice a week. Twice a week, I use it twice a week. This scrub, you're supposed to use one to two times a week. And Huda Beauty actually came out and said that with the Yoglo Enzyme Scrub, which is this one here, you can actually use this every day. If you want to use this every day and if it works for your skin type, then do it. She uses it every single day. I have only ever used this about maximum twice a week and she did say it depends on your skin type if you use it more than twice a week or more than what you usually do at the moment and it dries your skin out or it irritates then go back to using it only once or twice a week. We now have the beautiful Yo Detox face scrub. Now this beauty, I believe it has the exact same ingredients in the Yo Glow Enzyme but added stuff in it. So for example, pineapple and papaya enzyme is in both the Yoglo enzyme scrub and the Yoglo detox scrub. Witch hazel is in the detox scrub, not in the enzyme scrub. And this also has charcoal. So charcoal is in this scrub and it is not in the previous Yoglo enzyme scrub. And then they both have AHAs and BHAs. Because I have literally just washed my skin, my skin is feeling a bit run down and acting up for the last few days. Last day or so, I don't know why. I don't know if it's because I've just been like doing so many different makeup looks that my skin is just now reacting but it's been acting up a little bit. So let's go in with this detox. So directions for this beauty. Apply a generous amount on clean and dry skin. Gently massage in a circular motion to roll and sweep away impurities. Rinse well with warm water. Now I just have like a warm wet towel by my side so I'm just gonna use that. Oh, this is it here. Okay. So far, it feels very similar to the Yo to the Yoglo Enzyme Scrub. Like, just mainly by how it's working, how you rub it in, and then these little the dead skin falls off. It feels really good. It feels really good. So I'm just going to go in with my clean face towel. I kind of wipe my hands on it as well. So it feels pretty good. And my skin felt really dull and dry before. It's not feeling as dry. I'm just looking at my camera. I don't know if it's me, but I kind of feel that like my skin has just lifted slightly. Like, I feel like it's just giving my skin a little bit of a lift and like, it's just brightened slightly. Let me know if that is just me or if you guys see that too. So this product is suitable for all skin types. It is dermatologist tested. It purifies and detoxifies. It absorbs excess oil, unclogs pores and ingrown hairs, smoothing and evening. I 100% feel like my skin has just lifted and brightened and almost like it, I feel like before it just looked very dull Whereas now it kind of just looks, I don't know, it kind of looks just a little bit lifted and I'm, I'm liking how this is looking. The fact that this works on ingrown hairs is absolutely magical because you know we all get ingrown hairs and it is so annoying. So I cannot wait to use that for ingrown hairs. What I am going to do, I'm going to use this on my hands. Now, you can't really see on camera, but my hands get really dry sometimes, like they completely dry out to the point where it flakes up and like you can see it's all white and it's like so sore it goes red and when it gets really dry you can actually see cuts on my hands like it's a very it's, it's so annoying so 
let me just rub in like this. It feels so nice. It just feels like it's, it almost feels like it's soothing and softening. It feels so good. Seriously, my hands were so dry then. You cut, you couldn't see it properly on camera, but they were so, so dry. They feel so smooth now. What is this magic? They literally feel so smooth. I'm gonna quickly go wash my hands. I am just gonna wash my face just to make sure I've got everything off as well. And then I'm just gonna do the rest of my skincare. So I will be back. I just went ahead and did the rest of my skincare off camera as well. So I'm just gonna show you exactly what I used. After we washed off the Yo detox scrub. I went in with a little face mask from Revolution Skincare. Now this is in the blemish prone skin pack so it looks just like this. Now there's three different face masks. I went for the witch hazel one today which has aloe vera in it so it's this one here. It's so soothing and hydrating. It just, it literally feels amazing. And the few times that I have broke out, like once every month or so, I usually use one of their masks in the blemish prone skin pack and it literally usually soothes my skin and just calms down any spots. Like almost, I feel like I see it instantly, but overnight as well, it just kind of, it works its magic. I then went in with my Fenty Skin Fat Water Toner. That's something that I literally use every morning and every evening. Again, so hydrating, it's just amazing. And then we went in with the Wishful Skin Thirst Trap. Just, again, the best. So I have really dry skin, so this is just like perfect. It's so hydrating, it's got uh, hyaluronic acids, peptides, it is insane. The Get Even Rose Oil by Wishful Skin as well. This has got good stuff in it. Rose oil, carrot seed, rose hip, baobab. It and is just, it's something that using over time, I have seen such a difference with like pigmentation, uh, evening out skin tone, all that good stuff. Then I went in with the Wishful Skin Honey Balm, the jelly moisturizer. This is just like hydration in a tub. It's got good stuff in it like lavender, honey, turmeric, all amazing for your skin. Then, the Fenty Skin Overnight Gel Cream. Now, obviously this is something that I only use at night time. Ab absolutely amazing. The amount of times that my skin has felt rough or it's been breaking out and it feels horrible, when I use it at night time, I literally wake up and my skin feels so plump. It feels so hydrated and like, it just, just soft, softens and smooths out any like spots or redness that I've got. I love it. Fenty Skin Flash Nap Eye Cream. All of these products I have done a video on so if you do want to see a full video of those then just go and check them out. Something that I've been using recently. I've used it for I would say maybe a month now and I've seen such a difference. You can't actually see the label anymore because it's like wiped off but this is kind of the same label. It is the Rehab Lash Serum. Now, you literally just press this and it comes out with like drops of serum and then you just like put it on your eyelashes like that. I do that every single night and I'm telling you my eyelashes have thickened, lengthened. I was literally shocked at the difference and the improvement of my eyelashes. Like I didn't even think my eyelashes needed any TLC but I'm impressed with it. And then we finish off with the Rehab Overnight Lip Serum. Again, Revolution Skincare. That is it for the skincare. So my skin now feels great. I feel like it is glowing. And overnight, I feel like it will just feel even better. The Yo Detox Face and Body Scrub. I am impressed. I feel like it really, really got into the spots, like this particular parts in my skin on my skin that I needed it to get into. I feel like it lifted my skin straight away, it brightened, it felt so nice. It's obviously definitely good as a one or one to two times a week thing. We all have to have our little detoxes every every once or twice a week so I feel like it is perfect for that. On my hands, it's annoying that you couldn't see like the dryness on my hands before but my hands feel so smooth now, like so so smooth. This is something that I'm definitely going to be using on my hands a lot more because I do get really dry and sore hands. And I'm going to use this on my body as well to see how it performs. Again, another product from Wishful Skin 
that I am absolutely loving. Let me know if you guys have tried this product yourself and what you thought of that. If not, then let me know if you saw the results here in this video. Be sure to leave a like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you in my next video.